Conservation banquets starting to wrap up, but still a few out there. Pheasants Forever coming up next Saturday. It is the Medicine Creek Banquet. Well, two Saturdays from now. Frontier County Fairgrounds, a location that is in Stockville. Then on Friday, April 16th, Southwest Prairie Chapter. Now this is Quail Forever, Hitchcock County Fairgrounds, and that will be held in Culbertson. Ducks Unlimited Dinners, Banquets, Adams Dinner, and it's gonna be at the Cafe in Adams coming up on Saturday, April 2nd. Thursday, April 7th, the Aurora Dinner, Hamilton County Fairgrounds, the location for that, of course, in Aurora. And then Saturday, April 9th, it is the O'Neill Dinner in the Knights of Columbus Hall in O'Neill. Well, it's time to talk fishing. Glenn Elder, of course, the water temperature already starting to warm up in Kansas and elsewhere. One of the first things to take off, walleye. Fair action at walleye, some of them up to 24 inches along the dam at night, walk trolling with Rapalas. I, I did that a long time ago. It's, it's a lot of fun. Water temp is right around 48 degrees. White bass wipers, uh, white fair action there, 10 feet of water at the deepest, road runners, cast masters, slab spoons, and then wipers, fair action, some up to 22 inches or I should say some up to 20 some inches, 22 feet of water and chartreuse or white slab spoons along with cast masters working best. The crappie starting to take off fair action, some up to 14 inches, deeper water using jigs and minnows as is the favorite bait. And then trout, good action, some of those up to 16 inches and they're biting on Velveeta cheese. And the good thing is you can build a fire and make some grilled cheese sandwiches if you don't catch any trout. So there you go, power bait and worms working as well. At Lovewell, walleye, slow action. Some of those up to 27 inches though, Rapala's working and the white bass, fair action, 10 feet of water. Wipers also fair action, 20 feet of water. Pretty much the same as uh, Glen Elder baits, the Roadrunners, the Castmasters, and the Slab Spoons. A good action at Lovewell for crappie, up to 14 inches. Jigs and minnows and bobber, the Marina Slips and Cedar Point, a couple of the locations you may want to try. Well, that is the Outdoor Files for this week. Check out these sites along with Kansas Wildlife and Parks at this website on the bottom. And that is the Outdoor Files. Join me again next week. Sarah, back to you.